Hey guys, I want to take a moment just to walk through local Vikings GMB rank tracker. And firstly, let me say that this is pulling rank results directly through Google's API. And as we cross referenced a lot of the data that it brought back, we found it to be truly a, an extremely, extremely accurate way to track where your GMBs are ranking in a climate where, you know, over the last six to 12 months, we found that rank tracking has been lackluster to say the least. So let me show you guys how this works. It's really cool. Um, we're going to enter a business name and the location. So we're going to choose the Pizza Hut right here in Hanover. For the keyword, we're going to do pizza delivery and then we're going to choose our grid size so for this exercise I'm going to choose um, a 13 by 13 and then you can set the distance between grid points and a hundred meters is pretty close to around a hundred yards so that gives you that should give you a little bit of um, of a reference for those of you who aren't too familiar with the metric system and once you input your data you can go ahead and search and it just takes a moment to load up your results okay we have our results now obviously the green is going to be where this business is ranking the best the gray areas are the worst they're non-existent in that pack and the red areas obviously it's a simple color gradient scale to show you excellent all the way down to non-existent um, as a side note uh, please understand that very soon each of these nodes will contain a number and that number will tell you the exact GMB position of this business name and just to kind of make this feature um, a little bit more cool is when you click a node it'll actually pull up um, a, a modal that will have the the entire uh, list of GMB's ranking in that area from 1 through 20 so that'll really help to identify um, holes in your GMB optimization campaign uh, it'll help to identify spam listings and you know it's it's all around a great tool and we're gonna have plenty of content outlining how to use it the best um, and then one last thing is once you run a search it is saved here so you can go back and delete it or view the grid at a later time so very very cool feature and we hope you guys enjoy it